All right, let's do an application of finding the derivative of e to the x, or in this case, e to the stuff in x, and we're going to use the equation of the tangent line. All right, so remember, when we find the equation of a tangent line, I'm looking for the derivative so that I can get the slope, and then I'm going to use that slope and the point to get the actual equation of the line. So the first step I need to do is I need the derivative of 4e to the 2x plus 4. So the derivative would be 4. The derivative of e to the 2x plus 4 is itself times the derivative of the exponent. So the derivative of 2x plus 4 is 2. So my derivative is going to be 8e to the 2x plus 4. Okay, now to get my actual slope of the line, I need to use the x value of negative 2. So I'm going to plug in x equals negative 2. So when I plug in x equals negative 2, I'm going to get, let's see, 8e to the negative 4 plus 4. Okay. Negative 4 plus 4 is 0. Anything to the 0 is 1. So my slope is the number 8. All right. I'm now going to take that slope and this point and put it together. So my slope was 8. My point is a negative 2 comma 4. So we're going to use my favorite y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1. All right. I'm going to plug in the point 4, the slope 8, and the x value of negative 2. All right. I'm going to get y minus 4 equals 8 x, let's see, plus 2 times 8 is plus 16. And last but not least, let's move that 4 to the other side. So the equation of my tangent line to my curve at that specific point is y equals 8x plus 20. All right, good luck on your homework.